to another edition of the My Scotts Valley Weekly Show. I am your host, as always, Robert Aldana with MyScottsValley.com and also the Facebook page, Facebook.com forward slash MyScottsValley. We're in a very cool place today. We're actually in the dugout of the Scotts Valley High Falcons baseball field. Okay, and I'm sitting here with the uh, coach of the baseball team, Rick Erlin. How you doing, Rick? Doing well, thank you. Hey, I'm appreciative of you coming on to the show with us tonight because there's a few things that we want to talk about and just kind of let people know about in the community about your team. First and foremost, you guys got a pretty awesome field here. Thank you, thank <laughs> you. Now we uh, we put a lot of effort into it, and uh, we get a lot of support from the community as far as uh, funds to to maintain the facility, and okay. we're we're very proud of it. And the players are very proud. Of it. Excellent. And you know, you just hit on on a key point, and that is the support of the community. How important it is to get support from the various different businesses, from the people who live in the area. But not just that, but how important is it to have the actual parents, and even just if you're just a sports fan, to come out and watch your kids play. How how, how much do the kids love seeing a full stadium? Oh, I think they uh, they really really appreciate it. Uh, it. Just adds an extra energy to the mm -hmm. game. Uh, I think it, it keys them up, and they and they tend to respond to it. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent. Now I don't know if you know this, but baseball happens to be like my number one sport as far as I love baseball. I, I was just talking to Ann Smith earlier today, and we were just talking about how how much I enjoy the game. And if I was to have if if somebody would say you can only play one game for the rest of your life. It would definitely be baseball, and you got the look of a baseball coach. <laughs> you really do. Okay. So, uh, so that's a good thing. So, you've been coaching for a few years here at Scotts Valley High. Yeah, this is my third year in charge okay. of the program, and uh, I've been up here uh, since 2003, off and on coaching as an assistant. Okay, all right. And you played ball too back in the day, didn't you? Back in the day, yeah. Okay. Yeah, uh, I played a year at Cabrillo. Okay. Uh, JC ball. What position you play? I was a pitcher. Okay, I played third base and uh, catcher. <laughs> so there you go. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. So let's talk a little bit about your upcoming season. I know there's a lot of great expectations that are coming here. I've heard a lot of talk and I've read a lot of uh, different articles of people that are somewhat in the know here in the athletics. And they're talking about, you know, there's some pretty good expectations of you having a pretty good year this year. Yeah, we expect to be uh, very competitive this year. We have a really athletic team. Um, I think offensively will be one of the better teams in the league and defensively as well. Okay. Um, and we've got some good young pitchers coming up, and I think we'll be very competitive, and uh, hopefully we'll make a run for it this year. Okay, so it should be a pretty dynamic and fun year. And it's pretty easy to get here, folks. I mean, we're talking, we're, it's behind the Scotts Valley High School. It's right behind the football field. So everybody who lives in Scotts Valley or in the vicinity of Scotts Valley, you got to come out and watch a game because they're a heck of a lot of fun. Um, fundraising, the importance of people uh, given to the athletics uh, department, not just department, but just the whole over athletics uh, situation. We count, or you count so much on the various different businesses. We have an auction, or you have an auction coming up here in the near future, um, which is, what day is that? Uh, it's the 7th, next Friday, okay. February 7th, yeah, okay. at uh, 5.30 at Bruno's. Okay, and there's supposed to be some excellent prizes that are even given or, or auctioned off, right? Oh yeah, we've got some tremendous stuff, all donated from uh, local businesses in the, in the community, so it's, it's tremendous. In fact, we we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for that type of support. It mm -hmm. takes quite a bit to run a baseball program, and uh, I think the only other program that takes more is football. Okay. So yeah. it's it's pretty expensive sport. Yeah, and and you know, and you also wouldn't be here without all the people that are you know just working day and night to put this whole thing together. So you know, kudos to everybody who's been working on that auction. I know I've been hearing a lot about it, and it should be a lot of fun. And we're going to be putting some information here uh, on their website, so you can go on there and uh, get more information. If you're one of the businesses that I don't know if you folks are still taking more uh, things for your auction, but if you're a business that says, hey, you know what, I wouldn't mind contributing something to this particular auction, or even if you want to contribute throughout the year to the athletics here at Scotts Valley High School, here's a link right here so you can take a look at it and you can also follow to get much more information. Rick, I'm super excited about watching the season coming up. It should be pretty cool. Every year the season starts more or less in the beginning of February, okay, pretty much, right? right. Is that yeah, about right? Yeah, February 3rd we start our first practice and then uh, first scrimmage is uh, two and a half weeks after that and first game is uh, about three weeks after that. Okay, so. excellent. And how long does the actual season uh, uh, last? A couple, three we, months? Uh, we wrap up in the middle of May. Okay. Yeah, first okay. game is uh, end of February and, and then we wrap up the end of May. We expect to make CCS, so hopefully we'll be out there for a couple extra weeks. Okay, so. beautiful. So the regular season, the practice and everything really starts at the beginning of February. The regular season kicks in towards the end of February, is that correct? Uh, yeah, we have preseason games. Yeah, we yeah. have preseason games and we have league games, but yeah, the, the, the regular 
preseason games start in the last week of February. Beautiful. All right, Rick. Hey, listen, I appreciate your time. And I know you're a busy guy. You got a whole bunch of players over here just waiting to, to get coached by you. So thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, folks, if you can, get out to some of their games. Their graves are pretty fun. Uh, and, uh, you know, like we were talking about earlier, People travel like an hour, hour and a half. We were talking about this before we actually went on the air. People travel an hour, hour and a half to go see baseball games. Heck, there's some great baseball already being played in your own backyard here at Scotts Valley High School. I want to thank Rick Erlin. I want to thank Ann Smith for getting me in touch with them. And also for all the things that she's been doing because she's been doing a lot of work for the auction here coming up at Bruno's Barbecue. And, and she really deserves a lot of uh, credit for what she's done. And everybody else, all the parents and everybody who's been involved with the uh, athletics here at Scotts High School, not just in baseball, but football, you know, basketball, soccer. There's so many different uh, parts of the athletics that are part of Scotts Valley High School. We appreciate every single person that goes out and does something about it in terms of making it a little bit better for everyone else. Hey, thank you for watching. Thanks again, Rick, for being on the show with us. Thank My you for pleasure. watching this show. And uh, if you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, just post them right here on our Facebook page. If you don't know where our Facebook page and you're watching this somewhere else, Come on, you gotta visit our Facebook page. It's facebook.com forward slash MyScottsValley or you can visit our website at MyScottsValley.com. Thanks for watching, we'll be in touch. Beautiful.